Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Camilla for those of you that are new here. So today I wanted to make a video just on my cosmetology kit. So I got a lot of people interacting with my cosmetology videos, so I'm really happy about that. I'm glad that you guys are liking it. So someone actually messaged me saying that she watched my video and she said that she wanted to see what is in my kit. And I was really excited that she did DM me that because I was already planning on doing it. I actually did record this video before it just didn't turn out the way I wanted to so I just left it and I was like no nah, people are really don't want to see that anyways so I just didn't do it but she messaged me and I was like oh my gosh I'm gonna do it so um today that's what this video is um, I'm really excited and I don't want this intro to be too long because I know this video might be a little bit longer than the other videos that I have posted. In this video, I do want to go over everything that I did get from like books to mannequins to makeup, hair tools, hot tools, whatever it is, I want to share with you guys what exactly I got. So at my school, Summit Salon Academy, the books and kit fee is $3,000. So I was like, oh my gosh, we better be getting good stuff. I think every school is different and all the supplies are different. My school in specific, um, we do have partnerships with a lot of other brands. Like for example, my school is a Redken um, professional salon school. So we use a lot of Redken products. We use Mazzani products. We use a lot of Samvia um, tools, um, pivot point mannequins. I don't know if it's like that with every um, school. I'm pretty sure it's not but that's what summit salon academy does and i'm just gonna go over everything that my school offers you guys can see a mannequin right there i just noticed i'm just gonna show you guys what i got so let's get started okay so since i am doing online school i did leave a few stuff in my locker whenever we did come back um so i'm missing a few things in my kit like what I'm gonna show you, but I will try to put pictures up here um, just to show you guys what exactly we have and what they offer. I'm gonna start off with the mannequins. So I'm pretty sure we got like seven mannequins around that amount. So we got four of the same hair. So it's like a medium hair. I don't have one that's not cut. Um, probably this one, but it's up. So her hair goes down to like over here. I think I did trim this one a little bit but um this is the erica doll so i have four of these so i have this one that i cut i put lightener in her hair and i left it overnight um at the school i totally forgot i left it on top of my locker and whenever i came back and i only have night school so it literally was there the whole entire day I'm surprised her hair didn't fall out we have four of these mannequins they're all the same and then we also have a curly haired mannequin so like i said my mannequins are going to be really messy but we have a curly haired mannequin um i did i was practicing braids on her so that's what she has on and also we have one um boy <laughs> mannequin okay don't mind the messy hair like i'm I'm still practicing. I also have another one, but I did leave it at school and it's the long haired mannequin. She's like one of my favorite ones to practice like updos and things like that. It's um, blonde and it is a Maddie doll. So these are all pivot point mannequins. I'm gonna link it down below if you guys do wanna check it out. It is pretty expensive. Like I was really shocked to see. I can already feel that this video is gonna be one of the longest videos that I have because we just talked about mannequins and I'm like five minutes in probably. Okay, next I wanted to talk about hot tools. So we got two more cell irons. They, I don't know where my other one is. So we're just gonna, I'm just gonna show you guys one. The other one is a little bit thicker. Um, this is like really squeaky. I literally got it like that. I was like, I could have returned it and like gotten a new one, but I was just like, whatever, I wanna use it. So um, we got two curling ones. I have a straightener from Samvia and also a blow dryer from Samvia's. So some accessories that we have for the blow dryer um, are these two concentrators. So one is like a smaller one and then we have like a little thinner but longer one. And then we also have a diffuser. Okay, now combs and brushes. For like round brushes, we have these three. So we got a small one, a medium one, and a large one. They're all Samvia. We have three of these like um, wooden type brushes. 
but I don't know where my other one is. I think I left it in my locker. I don't even know. We got a paddle brush and then a, I forgot what this is called. And then we also have a nine road brush. I'll put a picture up here if you guys don't know what I'm talking about. And then also um, we got a like brush cleaner. Okay, now combs. So we got this like comb little bit thing. So this only came with like a few. I'm pretty sure it came with like eight and like each one had its like little pocket but since we do have other combs like our cutting comb that wasn't in our kit my teacher gave to us so i just added that i added this in here we have our clipper comb that we got in another kit so i just all of the combs that we've received i put it in here so the only ones that came are these like samvia combs um they're really nice so next i wanted to show you guys our shears so um if you guys don't know th those are like the scissors that we use to cut hair they're not called scissors because they're not long enough to be called scissors they're called shears I learned that at school so this is a feather razor so since we are cosmetologists we're not allowed to use like a straight blade or straight razor or whatever they're called like barbers do so this is kind of the same thing just different <laughs> so the kit also came with 10 other blades so it came with one in here and also 10 more so that's really good so this one is a blending shears it's like this and then we got a normal shear so um we got this one cleaning supply type thing for our shears so it comes these little bands things so this is for your where your finger goes if your finger is a little bit too small or too big you can take this out and just like adjust it so if your finger is really small you guys can use like the little ones or the bigger ones whatever we also have in here this is a tightener so sometimes our shears can be a little um, loose this is where this comes in you just come here and tighten it or loosen it whatever and then we also have a sheer oil the next thing that i wanted to show you guys is our little caddy so this is a pivot point caddy this is just where we keep all of our tools i took everything out so i can show you guys how exactly it looks so if we want to use it as a little side bag thing we can or you can just hold it like this in the front here we have a little pocket this i just like to keep some of my blades in here and then inside here we have the area to put all of your shears texturizer blending shears whatever and then over here we just have areas to put brushes um hot tools and it does have a divider in here and also a little clip to hold everything in just turning it to the side we have these two little compartments i don't honestly i don't store anything in here you can probably put bobby pins little clips like that this um we can store uh, maybe your water bottle you can store a um product in here i like to i'll like show you guys at the end my setup and you guys can see how exactly i use this thing over here and then just turning it a little bit over we have this compartment type thing um i like to keep my clips in here in here same thing as the other side it did come with this extra thing attached and you can take it out if you like and it can be its own little bag i like to store my apron in here and also my extra capes inside of this bag let me just get up for this one they also gave us a suitcase it's pretty big it's a little storage place right here on the side here you can also store a few things of yours and on this side it's like a heat side so you can put like hot tools in here that are hot and it's not gonna like burn into your bag so i think that's really cool since i'm already standing up i'm gonna show you guys also they gave us a tripod on to the next section which is nails since cosmetology is mainly hair related they didn't give us that many things for like makeup hair waxing things like that they just gave us like a little basic kit for each specific thing so for our nails they gave us a gel set so at our school i'm pretty sure we are partnered with se and opi so that's like the main products that we use so for our gel kits we usually use opi this is what the kit comes with so it came with a red color 
and also a light pink one and then a top coat and a base coat and then also they gave us this it's like a removal wrap thing so we also got this little nail manicure thing so we got a cuticle pusher i don't know what they're actually called is that what they're called a cuticle cutter i don't know we got a little nail clipper and then tweezers scissors and then a toenail clipper so that is what comes in here this again is pivot point this is what um our kit comes with in here comes a clipper a trimmer and then like the little add-ons now off to my favorite section which is makeup so for our makeup line that we use we use mud makeup i never heard of them before our, i came into this school so we got this little bag and in here comes four different shades of foundations got another compartment thing for our blush and then we also got four different shades of eyeshadow a lipstick a loose powder my favorite one is is this eyeliner i really really love this they gave us these sponges and then also it came with this little disposable paper palette and also they gave us a little spatula to dig out the foundation and place it on the palette next they did give us two brushes this one can be like an eyeliner brush it's really really thin and then this one is more of like a flat flat maybe like a pack packing on shade i don't even know but that is it for the makeup so i also wanted to add a few things that we got that aren't like beauty related this little sanitizer then they gave us like a to-do list this little pen and it's like a stylus pen so i can use it whenever i'm doing my work and then they also gave us books so these are just a couple books that i have i have a whole bunch i'm pretty sure it's like 12 lessons that we have so they gave us this and also a study guide that i have in my locker and then of course i have my ipad that they gave us so this was also part of our kit okay so since i just showed everything in my kit i want to set up my caddy and put all of my hair products and hair tools things like that in here so you guys can see the how it actually looks if you guys do want a video on how i do set up this caddy to just fit everything and have everything looking organized let me know in the comments down below and i would love to do that but Right now, I'm just going to do it really quick and I'll show you guys the final product. Okay, so, I just finished my little setup right here. So, this is what it looks like. Usually, I like to store this inside my suitcase whenever I'm going to school. Um, I just put it in my suitcase so it doesn't like move around my car. I'm hoping that I talked about everything in my kit. If not, I'll add things here and there. Yeah, that is it for today's video. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. We're almost at 200 subscribers, which is insane. So if you guys do want to join the family, please subscribe and like this video. And turn on the post notification bell to be notified whenever I do post a new video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and found this video very helpful.